They called home, not for the weak, left out in the cold. Watched all the sheep do what they told. Sure they would feast one day on their bones. Back with the form of a beast. Tapos na yung KG Classic So ngayon yung mga videos na i-upload natin ngayon Is about tutorials, workout videos And right now, I'm uploading shoulder workout Ito yung first video natin after yung competition So, yung mga susunod pang videos dyan uh, Watch out guys Kasi magbibigay ako ng mga tips Para i-incorporate nyo dun sa mga Uh, workouts nyo, pwede sama nyo siya tapos try nyo kung mag-i-hit sa inyo para doon sa makuha nyo yung V-taper na gusto nyo. So, target this off season, mas magandang V-taper, mas maliit na waist, mas, maha, mas malapad ng shoulder, tapos mas magandang back. Yung may make point natin last, oh, uh, last combination. Ika ka naman yun, sharing is caring, di ba? So, workout natin, kailangan natin mag-focus lahat ng heads yung anterior side and rear delt natin to have a 3D delt okay so watch out shoulder workout so para ma-activate natin agad yung buong shoulder natin heavy compound workout kagad seated dumbbell press so itong video na to is my last set I'm uh, attempting 45kg ang kabila so top set siya uh, nasa 8 to 10 reps so depende kung may spotter ka or kung kaya mo pero minimum natin is 8 so tip lang if you have trusted spotter like this coach yung kasama natin sa work ay uh, you need to go all out para ma-maximize kagad yung gains natin at ma-maximize yung strength building and muscle building natin so go all out walang magre-reserve sa susunod na exercise isipin nyo madami pang exercise so magre-reserve ako no go all out ganun, ganun ang pagka-training guys hindi yung puro reserve puro reserve go all out for the first exercise lalo na kung compound exercise yan to maximize the muscle gains guys then after that last set drop set tayo guys kung ano yung weight na binuhat nyo nung last set kunin nyo yung half nun then go for 2 partials 1 full for 10 reps Ta, uubusin natin yan na parang wala ng exercise na kasunod next exercise after doing all the presses we will do some giant set by getting the rear delt the, the lateral head so combination to ng lateral tsaka rear delt so let's start with cable crossover yung angle niya is parallel straight lang so we will hit it with two different angles mamaya yung rear delt natin in the middle of that mag static dump and lateral raises tayo so it will show later in this video kung paano yung static dump and lateral raises so sa mga hindi pa nakakagawa nito maganda to para sa lateral head mo ng shoulder to give you more wider taper ng body and then maganda tong pang stimulate ng lateral head ng shoulder mo para mas lalong ma-emphasize yung pump dun sa shoulder mo so the execution is you need to hold the other hand while the other hand will do the designated reps so after the singles 
you will raise them both for five concentrated reps. And right after, you will go back again to cable cross over your delt fly with the angle diagonal. Execute it again for 15 reps and feel the pump. So right after that four sets of giant set, we will go for another giant set, focusing on anterior delt, the front delt. Started with seated machine hammer press for 12 to 15 reps. And also guys, try to increase the weight each single set. Control as much as possible para ma feel nyo doon sa contracted area. After that, set up your table for front raises, doing 12 to 15 reps, and then try to lift the handle higher to your chest level and squeeze it on top and control the eccentric. The technique para ma engage mo siya properly is to lift mo yung handle hindi straight to the ceiling kung hindi palayo doon sa katawan mo. That's the secret doing the front raises. And right after that, pick a pair of dumbbells and do the Y abs, Y raises. This is good activating also your anterior delt. And try to control the eccentric again for maximum muscle gain. And don't forget to try to increase the weight each single set to increase the maximum intensity. And after the giant set, we will do some isolation work with the lateral head, the shoulder, trying to do the single arm cable lateral raises with three sets of trap set. So you can see, I'm using some ankle strap to my wrist, just to closer the resistance to my lateral head by executing the single arm lateral raises and I'm not focusing on gripping the handle I'm just focusing on lifting the weight by my shoulder so kung walang available na ankle strap pwede naman din ulit gawin yung may handle so same pa rin, 3 sets of drop set And after that, we will focus on the rear delt by doing the overhead grip face pull and super side with other hand grip face pull. Do it for 2 sets of 15 reps and another 2 sets of 12 reps each. This super set will also activate the traps in the rear delt muscles. Don't forget to squeeze and contract each single rep 
to maximize the effectiveness of this super set. Next, we will hit again the traps and the shoulders with these two different exercises starting with cable shrugs for 15 reps and cable upright rows for 15 reps. For the cable shrugs, don't forget to stretch and squeeze on top. Don't execute fast reps on these shrugs. So after that, drop the weight to half and para ma-execute natin ng maayos yung cable upright rows. So for this cable upright rows, just lift the elbows into your shoulder level. Don't go more higher because it will pinch your rotator cuff. It goes low for the centric for maximum gains. And for the finisher, we will go all out by the Smith machine press. So we will do for 5 slow tempo, 5 fast, and again 5 slow tempo and 5 fast tempo for 2 sets. And don't forget to increase the weight each single set. And after that 2 sets, give it all for another 2 sets for 4 slow tempo, 4 fast tempo, slow for slow and for fast tempo. So do it for two sets again and increase the weight each single set.